So you murdered. Murdered? No, I was playing with him with a knife when it happened. Are you sorry? He killed himself. Oh, oh please don't cry, Mom. Are you going to laugh? You don't always laugh when people cry. Should I punish you? Oh, no. I don't want to be punished. What did you do wrong? Do you know? I played with other children. Why? Why? I had to. I'm not angry. They found me. One of them then hit me. I know, I know. They will do well to you by far in the future when they catch you. Come. Jackie? Yes, sir. <coughs> Sorry. Much, much better. Huh? Much, much better. Oh, I'm a bad lover. Did you ever see? Carpe, look at how many say. People never stop to think about dry leaves. They think they're all dead. <laughs> Aren't they? Oh, no, they're not. They just change their form. Come on. Those of you who will believe, and those of you who refuse to believe, help you, so to do, before it is late. Black Swan Winter. I'm looking for audition pieces. Mm. <coughs> Come on, Stephen. We've got to get ready for that party. Flat. You were going to see a flat, weren't you, today? Oh, what I'm happened? talk about that. No good? <laughs> You'll be joking, baby. I've been to see about three flats today. <laughs> oh, what happened? 
Oh, well, they all took one look at me. I started shouting something about rabies and closed the door. <laughs> no, seriously, I don't know. There must be some kind of conspiracy about it. <laughs> well, he's never landed. He's always landlord. <laughs> Why don't you get a decent job? You don't want to wash dishes for the rest of your life. Huh? Who's washing? Who wash dishes? Yeah, crazy. Don't wash dishes. I'm a second cook. Oh, sorry, sorry. <laughs> well, why don't you try and do some acting or something? You've done some acting, haven't you? Well, I'm acting all the time, aren't I? Yeah, I know, but... No, but seriously, man, you know, every time I go and try to get a job doing stomach work or something, they say I'm too white. When I try to get a flat, I'm too black. I never knew if I'm coming or going. Are you joking? That's how it goes. That's life in London. <laughs> hey, how about that play you're doing? Talking about acting. It's coming along very well. You should come see rehearsal sometime. Oh, yeah. But you don't have a job for me. As an also work wise actor. Hey, who's is this? Oh, it's a friend of mine. Oh. Hmm. Sorry. You can go out if you like. No, no, no. It's all right. What shall I wear? Tonight? Mm. Why don't you wear that, um, that no, the oh, brown jacket, the brown jacket, and uh, that new shirt of yours. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's a good idea. Mm. 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 Hey, we're gonna have a ball tonight. Do you think so? Oh yeah. There'll be a lot of people there. Oh yeah. A lot of very beautiful people with nice songs. Really? What sort of sounds? Jamaican sounds. Mm -hmm. Reggae and rock steady and all that jazz, man. Have you ever heard rock steady? No, I don't think so. Oh, it's beautiful. Is it? Yeah. the only group that is oppressed, the black people, I No. Who is oppressed? Otherwise than myself. Everybody that's a minority Everybody, is oppressed. Every, no, 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 no. You didn't say everybody who's, who's a minority, did you? Everybody's a minority. No. Minority of everybody is a minority. Everybody is it's oppressed. Yeah. Everybody, including the system itself, is oppressed by its own system. But why should I have to expose my, my, my thoughts and my ideals to people I uh, uh, may, not, you know, may not want to look at? What do you mean, why? Why? Uh, if you Aren't you a human being? <coughs> you are all human beings. Well, yeah, true we are, but uh, uh, to an extent I have, have my reservations, you see, about... Uh, because I'm white? Well, I wouldn't say that, but... Uh, uh, I, I, I'd say this, uh, we're at odds. What do you mean, we're at odds? Well, uh, we either share it, you know, like it has to be, it has to come from your people, man. Like, we, we're, we're no longer convincing you that we're serious about this or that we want a part of, of a society or a part of the white establishment. See, that's what it really boils down to. It's your establishment, man, not ours. We bought, paid for it, died for it, but it's not ours, it belongs to you. So, since we paid for it and bought it with sh uh, blood and, 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 you know, the, ho the whole black nation as a whole, either we uh, uh, share it, we will burn it up, well, nobody will have it. Hey, man, you enjoy yourself? Your name's Stefan? That's right. I know you. Oh, 
You know Sarah? My cousin Sarah Stefan, don't go. Where are you going? Well, I see you just don't. Stefan, but I want to see you. That I witness here, most of, if not all, of our leaders, teachers, and philosophers. The leaders tell them, vote for me. I'll keep your promised land. And they do. I mean, they keep your promised land. The leaders. The intellectuals are conditioned to condition us to love thy neighbor. We are conditioned. But we, shall not condition. we are conditioned to kill by fear, of course. And we do kill, man. kill, kill. <laughs> Buddha the enlightened one, and they call Mohammed the enlightened one, not God. All these people come down here to preach us, to tell people a certain message, because they were highly evolved souls, which all of us will become like them eventually, and all of us are potentially highly evolved, if only we could open our minds and realize all this, you know. And all these people, all these people came here, all they preached was love. Isn't that this, this, this was the sort of basic fundamental thing behind all societies, whether they were African, European, or whatever it is. I'm one of your little flunkies from Trinidad. What's that? I'm one of your little flunkies from Trinidad. I don't understand the language. Trinidad? No, I don't understand. Flunky. Oh, flunky means that uh, whatever you say, I do. <laughs> yeah. I don't get it. I'm your puppet. By the system, I am your puppet. You are my master. When all this is going to pass, because the whole planet we live in has moved through the Piscean age and is moving to the Aquarian age. And in the Aquarian age, all the machines we produce, all the computers, are going to give us all the facts about life. All the things that, they, that they, they've been taking years to, be pro to prove are going to be proven. <laughs> <laughs> if you if you have a, if your heart's weak, you know your aura has a different color. It, 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 it goes from a bright sort of golden to a very dim kind of yellow, mm -hmm. and all that. It loses its. It, 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 it. And everybody has this aura, and, and if you get this fantastic energy, as I was saying, you know, purify yourself. This energy could come out in ultraviolet light, which they have in machines, and you could actually put your hand on somebody who's ill. And, and cure that, that illness. That is the power. That is, the, in fact, the great power. That would be the power that, that the Christ greatest, had when yeah, he was yeah, dead. Jesus. Yeah, just Christ. touch his garments and you yeah. get cured. Right? And you get cured. And a lot of people have it in, le in lesser and greater, milder ways, like somebody comes in a room, and they have this fantastic, peaceful aura about them that always draws people to them, you know? But can you rationalize that? Well, no, I don't rationalize it. That's a reality. That's a fact. You know that, as well as we all know that, you know? There are some people coming to a room and you get a distinct, uh, you know, reaction, yeah, reaction yeah. towards them. Some of them come in and they look as though they're ill or they're, they're tired. Yeah. We all are like that in our own selves, up and down too as well, you know. When we yeah, die, we it. pass over and we become another, then there's another reality when you're dead. Sorry, yeah. This is called a discarnate state. We leave this incarnate state, we go to a discarnate state. All the mind, all the thing you're thinking goes into another form. And that's another world called the astral world. That's the same thing I'm talking about. How would you identify yourself with what's happening? Around? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, when I, what, from the, when I first came to this country, for instance, you know, I was, I, had a, I was a completely different scene. For instance, if I had to buy a bed, I would buy the springs and then get the mattress <laughs> because I believe I would sleep on a bed. <laughs> so, you know, it's that kind of way around, you know. Yeah. yeah. If, I, you know, like you have ideas about being this and being that and doing that and doing the other, you know, and you sort of follow certain patterns and you, you have all these sort of insecure feelings that you're not good or you're not beautiful or you're not white, if that's how you feel. Have you been or influenced by this society in any way since you came to England, for example? I had to go through a lot of suffering, I think, you know. I had to sort of live on my own for quite a long time. I, and then, and then I even felt to commit suicide at one time, really. <laughs> True, you know. <laughs> I believe you. Oh, really? I live in a room for about three years, you know, and mm -hmm. you, don't, you, don't, you don't really know what you're going to do next. And, What's, what's happening, you know? 
things you, you, you're taught before, you know, like, to, you, you know, when you're young, to pray and all that, you just reject all that, you know, you don't believe in God, you don't believe in all that kind of thing. And you know, now, and then slowly, you just, I just kind of, you know, I, it's funny, I go right around, go around the whole circle, really, you know. All the things that I wanted, all the people that I wanted to meet, and all the things that I wanted to have, it doesn't bother me anymore. I start off exactly where I go back, I, I come the whole circle, exactly where I started off. And all the people that seen at one time that maybe they weren't sort of illuminated, they haven't reached anything. In fact, are the people, to me now, who have, who have reached the highest form of existence, the highest form of relationship with me and with what I, what I believe in, what I feel. About it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 